Hey guys, welcome to your Lunch and Learn, where we take about three to five minutes to teach you guys something really cool about your health so you can start making health gains on a daily or even weekly basis. You guys, today we're gonna to talk about this idea of a morning routine. Now, the way your day starts is the way your day goes. So if you can start your day with a bunch of small wins, watch these wins stack up and watch yourself have an amazing day and an amazing week and eventually even an amazing life, okay? Now, when we're talking about wins in your day and trying to start your day right, you get to realize this. The thing that takes us off the track, off the rails, and can send us in the wrong direction as fast as possible is this idea of stress. But stress comes in different forms. We don't want to be overwhelmed. We want to keep our body moving forward in all things we do. So the first thing you guys can do, we got three easy tips, and the first thing you guys can do every single day when you wake up is drink two glasses of water. We know how important our water is. We know how important that is for, our every, for every bodily function we have. If you guys want to have better digestion, have, have healthier skin, have more energy, it all starts with water. And at minimum, you need to be consuming at least half your body weight in ounces. So two glasses in the morning helps you jumpstart that amount of water you're intaking and get your body working too. Now, and a, and a bonus tip for that too, if you guys have any digestive problems, instead of having cold water, try warm water even hot water in the form of tea even. This actually dilates different vessels, putting more blood into the GI tract and helping move stuff along that system faster too, okay? Tip number two, get your body moving. You guys, I don't care if it's an F45 class, if it's CrossFit, or if it's a 10 minute walk outside around the block. When you get your body moving, that starts the systems and the processes in place too. It gets your energy up, it gets you going forward, and that small win makes the rest of the day a lot easier too. And then tip number three, probably my favorite tip that I do on a daily basis now, uh, the idea of taking a cold shower. And I know that sounds crazy, right? We have hot water for a reason, but a cold shower, a little bit of cold at the end of the shower actually stresses your nervous system, which we think is bad, but in reality, that small amount of stress helps build the resiliency and the strength of your nervous system. It's like going to the gym. If you go to the gym and you start increasing the weight a little bit every time you go, you get stronger and stronger, building those muscles. The same thing can happen when you stretch your nervous system. And one of the best ways to do that in the morning is to end your shower with a small amount of cold. So at the end of your shower, I don't care if it's warm, hot, cold, at the end of the shower, make sure you do three rounds of cold water for 20 seconds with warm water in between. Now, you're not going to like it at first, and that's fair. Most people don't like things in life that make them better. But when you do this, you start building up the resiliency in that nervous system. And as a chiropractor, we know how important the resiliency in your nervous system really is. That's why we do that HRV check with all you guys. That's exactly what that's measuring. And the better you become at taking on the stress that life gives you, the healthier you are going forward. So you guys, if you could implement those three tips, that simple, just those three things on a daily basis, I guarantee your morning routine will be improved compared to where it is currently. And if you improve your morning, you improve your day. If you improve your day, you improve your life. So you guys, hopefully that makes some sense to you. If you have any questions, let us know. Uh, comment below. If you have any friends who are looking for a better morning routine but have no idea where to start, make sure you share this video with them. And if you have friends who need chiropractic care, you guys, you know what we do. Tell them all about us. We'd love to help them out if we can. So until next time, you guys, have a great day, and I'll see you soon.